Welcome back. In a Fox Carolina investigation, DNA swabbing is now being used to help match you to the right medications. Major pharmacies, including Sam's Club, are now using this technology. But doctors say it hasn't been accredited and it isn't widely accepted among medical professionals. They say the cheek swabbing has now been used for a while, but it's just starting to make its way into the big name pharmacies. Pretty interesting here. Fox Carolina's Kayla Convoy is live for us right now. So, Kayla, what else is this DNA test actually doing? Well, it's actually sifting through several medications to see if it would be a right fit for you, and it can even point out if you might be allergic to a certain medication, but doctors that we spoke to say it's not always foolproof. It's a simple cheek swab, and within a week, your results are back. Basically, an extra safety net, and this brings a whole nother lens to it. It can actually help guide therapy. Raymond Westrick is a pharmacist at the Greenville Sam's Club. He says in the grand scheme of things, this DNA testing can help save you money, saying it eliminates trial and error. A simple cheek swab can save the doctor, you know, a few extra steps. You know, it's going to eliminate, you know, should we try this one? Should we try that one? Doctors admit they do use the technology in certain cases, but the ones we talk to say the DNA testing for medical matches is not generally accepted. People who may have a certain genetic condition or the gene type don't necessarily express that gene type. So, for example, you might be um, somebody who has uh, genetics for disease A, but you don't have any symptoms of gene, gene, disease A. It's called penetrance, and Dr. David Brancotti says it's typically used by doctors when a patient is not getting better or not responding to a certain medicine. The biggest one we use it for is a medication called Plavix for people who have heart disease, and sometimes they're still having problems, and we want to check and see is the Plavix you know, effective or Coumadin or some of those type of things. He says there is some potential, but it hasn't been proven on a broad panel using multiple medications. Sam's Club is one of the first big name companies to start offering the testing, saying they currently have 200 commonly prescribed and over the counter medications they are running your DNA for. We've had a lot of foot traffic in here for the testing. So, and it's, you know, if you're just starting out on a, you know, a child or somebody on a medication, it would be good to have the foresight to be able to say, you know, whether it's going to work or not. The testing here at Sam's Club is $269. That's a lot cheaper than other places, but doctors say a lot of insurance companies will also pick up those costs if the situation does depend. And Dr. Broncotti, who we spoke to earlier, says while it is useful in some cases, he says it's probably not ready for everyone to be using for all medication. Reporting live in Greenville, Kayla Convoy, Fox Carolina, B10 o'clock news.